Well, it's always been pretty good formula, you know. And I did we have a turnover? Uh, we did, did we? It's kind of a weird game with some things and some no calls and some calls. And I'm really interested in what to take, but yeah, it's gonna be proud of our group. You know, I, I just told them, I'm telling you, other than the people in that room, a bunch of the folks we had here, and there's others out there too, and their families. I'm not sure many people thought we could get it done, and uh, we believed it. And, uh, and it just really took everybody. I mean, great job defense, great job offense. And Ian Williams, you know, we, we did some things in the kicking game we don't normally do. Uh, but, man, that was a huge kick for him to do that and go up by two scores. And I just told him that, you know. And so, uh, but no, just proud of our team. You know, like I said, not the people they did us, but we believe in ourselves. Uh, just talk about the, the running game. I thought it got better as the game went along. And well, you know, I, I thought it got better after you made a first down. You know, we always talk about that. Go make a first down. That second one's a whole lot easier. And you could just see him. And, man, you know, what he did and those guys up front, you were down with Luke Pettit. And then, you know, uh, Pearson wasn't available the whole game. And they just kept those tight ends. We were a lot of 12, two tight ends in the game. Mine Hicks, I don't know if he had a carry, but he had a bunch of good blocks. Wayne, some of the runs he had. And then. <coughs> Certainly, uh, Tyler, that was a pretty sight. Seeing him pull that one out of there and, and go down through there. But uh, no, just really, really great team effort. There, there's belief in yourself. Could you ever imagine holding that team to three points in one half and second half on their home turf? No, no, I, I can't say I thought we'd do that. I really don't because they certainly are good. Uh, I don't know. I just told you, know, y'all hear me say this all the time games about matchups. You know, and yeah, I don't, you know, I don't put a whole lot of stock in who you've done this and this score. Ten days, how do you line up? And I just think we're a solid football team in every phase. We can run it, we can throw it. We've been really good special teams, weren't real good today. Uh, and then defensively, you know, we get after the passer, which we did. And, like I said, I, 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 I felt like we'd match up pretty good. Now, I actually didn't believe we could do that. Uh, I'd be remiss if I didn't mention the defensive line in the game they played today. You know, they, they, this team only had three sacks. You know, I think two of them to Arkansas. And you guys go out there and get well, out. Well, I think their offense line maybe had more tackles than we did sometimes. You know, I just, I, I'm really kind of, I just watched our guys get pulled down and. Little, really, really frustrated with that. But you know what? They just kind of kept working, kept working. I saw a couple times they were just effort sacks. They didn't give up on something. And, um, but no, like I said, I just, I mean, golly, the whole group. It, it took everybody, and you knew it would. Uh, but yeah, just to be able to come up here and get that done. Yeah. We got a good team. I, I've said that all along. We, you know, we got, we're a team that has got to. Got to play well. We got to execute every week. We talked about from the start: toughness, you know, execution, and, uh, and discipline. And I thought, for the most part, we did a good job of that. How does this team seemingly take it to another level on the road? Well, I just think they're so consistent. You know, we're not relying on the crowd to make us play well. I mean, that helps, and you like that. But I mean, I don't know. I don't know these days. That just seems like it should be a big part. But and day you put 11 out there, they put 11, you got to go play, you got to go execute. And I think it's just make, make up our kids and our coaches do a phenomenal job of preparing our guys. And our guys knew what, what it was going to be about. You know, we talked about winning the first quarter and we knew we to start get out fast. And, uh, no, they've just been consistent. That doesn't mean you always play like you want to every time, but the effort's always consistent. I think the toughness aspect of it, and then again, I just think, you know, just the execution is just something. And we'll go watch this as much things we could have done which is a good thing. Thank you, guys. Hey, I thought it looked pretty good. Good look. What time is it? Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. Are we, are we all, hey, yeah, all yeah, right yeah, here? Yeah. I'll let you start now. Uh, Dom, just, you know, the, the, I mean, sometimes you were having to break tackles, but a lot of the time you were getting huge holes to run through. Just talk about, again, the offensive line continues to build on, on what they've done the entire season. Gosh, they played a great game today. Um, I'm proud of those guys. They're going through some things, you know, with some bumps and bruises, and they just continue to push through and dig deep, and I'm just blessed to run behind a bunch of guys like that, you know, and, you know, have an awesome coordinator that trusts me with the ball. I never get to face Western Carolina again. Does that make you a little sad? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a little bit. You know, I've had my best games against them. So, um, no, that's a great group over there. They got a lot of great players. Um, you know, I always love their competitive nature. They're always talking trash. It keeps it, it keeps the game pretty entertaining. Um, 
just talk about you know the the, the last play that Tyler game pulls in. Is that something that he saw or after the timeout? What was the play call? I mean, what did he see on that? What made him pull down? That's just tee up, being tee up. Um, he could pull it. He could pull it the whole time. Um, but you know, choose his moments wisely. That was the best time to pull it, and you saw the result of it, you know, know, however many yards that was for a touchdown and uh, sealing the game. So, kudos to him. For those of us not athletic enough to ever know what it feels like, what does it feel like to run the ball like you did? When you get it back with like five minutes left, you know you got to run this clock. And for you to just chunk five, chunk six, chunk seven. It feels like you're fighting with oxygen, you know. <laughs> but even if you're not athletic, I know, I'm sure you know what it feels like to be gasping for air, but you know. We, we prepare for that stuff in uh, the summertime with Bernardi and, you know, just pushing through, you know, that tiredness, you know, that fatigue, and just, you know, getting that next first down. That was, that was all about mine. Thanks, Tom. Thanks, Tom. Good luck.